afternoon baseball here on the show. Today we've got a good matchup ahead between the Los Angeles Angels of Anaheim and the All-Stars. It's baseball. It's the show. And it comes your way next. Antonio Senzatella is on the mound for game two. What do you have for us on him, Danny? If you want to pick up a win as a starting pitcher, you have to go five innings to get the win, and that's just what he did the last one. I'm sure he'd like to be out there for a little bit longer in this one. Stepping in, Andrelton Simmons. He will lead this one off today. Leading off the afternoon for the Angels, the shortstop, Andrelton Simmons. First pitch of the at bat. Line to the right side. Therefore, it is Garcia, and he's got it for the first out. Got it, second. The second baseman. David. So stepping in, Fletcher. David Fletcher. He's ready for his first at bat of this early season contest. Now the pitch. A One ball out. and no strikes. Guys, you take a look at the home nine as they enter play here this afternoon. They dropped another one last time out, and in fact, they've won just twice in their last eight tries. What an opportunity to get a chance to put our eyeballs on one of the best teams in baseball right now. This team has played so well. Their manager has been on point. Every move he makes is working. Timely hitting. Great defense. Good bullpen. The starters have been on point. This is going to be special. One and two now. Sunshine starting to break through a bit after a cloudy morning. 57 degrees here at game time. Swung on in the dirt for the third strike. And he makes the throw to first. Fletcher is retired. Two down now. Here's the center fielder Mike Trout. And he's definitely off to a fast start in the early part of the season. First offering on its way. All one, no play. And set up behind the plate is Kenny Jansen, as you see the rest of the umpiring crew there. Hey, the book on Kenny Jansen, D Road, not a very big zone, but he will give you that low pitch below the knees. Yeah, and he's consistent. You're okay with that as an offensive player. He wants to give that pitch below the knees. If... And Trout has himself a base hit. Throw into second. The tag, and they'll get him at second. And with that, the side is retired. Angels are gone in order. We'll go to the bottom of the first in a scoreless ball game. Jaime Berea, the Panamanian right-hander, will get the nod here. Dan, any thoughts? Yeah, Matt, his last start wasn't very good. Knocked out after three innings and took the loss. They're expecting much more from him, and he needs to get off to a flying start in this one. These Angels, as they enter play here this afternoon, fellas, they look to make it three straight here as they come in on the heels of two straight wins. Yeah, Matty, they started yesterday off on the right foot. If they could put together two games in a row, a lot of positive vibes start happening. You never know. This could be a jump start to big things. This one's flared off to the right side. Otani is in a few steps as he takes it for the first down. The second baseman. So the base is empty here with one away, and that'll bring up Glaber Torres. First pitch coming, here it is. A swing and a ground ball to third, and that'll just sneak past his outstretched arm, a base hit. That is third. The shortstop, Rafael Duquez. Standing in now, Rafael Duque. As the first pitch to him runs a bit inside for ball one. He's got that batting average up over 350 now. Two home runs, nine driven in. The 1 0. Hits this one hard the other way. And that's through for a hit. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. Boy, that's one of the, I guess, the advantages of hitting with that hole between first and second base, d -roll. First baseman has to hold that runner on. That leaves that right side wide open. Yeah, and credit the batter right there. Nice piece of hitting right there. Not trying to do too much. He took a look at the defense and saw where it was aligned and tried to beat him. 
And that'll bring up the veteran Miguel Cabrera. And as you can see, he has been slumping offensively. First delivery to him on the way. Heading out towards shallow right. On the run is Otani. He gets there, and that's the second out. So here's Avisayu Garcia. He's ready for his first at bat of this early season contest. Here comes the pitch for Garcia. Hit back up the middle. And that's through into center field. Base hit. He'll come home with it. Ah, but this is well up the line, and he's safe at home plate. Hey, that's a big RBI single right there, D-Row. They lost the first game of this series, and they certainly don't want to fall behind and may potentially lose the first two games of this set. Without question, Dan. Offensively, you're just trying to grind it out, give your team a chance, give the pitcher a chance to relax a little bit, even the series up, hopefully, and fight it out tomorrow. And here's Renato Nunez. Oh, and this is hit high and deep out to left. But that'll stay in the park as it's off the wall. And to score is the runner from third. It's a 2-0 ball game. And he is in there. The pitcher's jumped out of the frying pan and into the fire here. A second run scores. And now he's got two men in scoring position. And his danger of letting this thing get completely away from him. We'll see if he can put out the fire here or if the inferno rages on. Here's cargo Carlos Gonzalez as the first pitch misses high and inside for ball one. He's got a chance to add to this early lead as he'll bat with a couple of guys in scoring position. Well this won't get over the second baseman's glove as he's got it to end the inning. So it's two runs on four base hits. No errors and a couple of men left on. We move ahead to the top of the second now. Venezuela leads it two to nothing. In now is Anthony Rendon, a silver slugger winner a year ago in the National League. Hey, we're still in the early stages in this one. They're only down by a couple of runs. But it's really key for this leadoff guy to try to get on and get a big inning started. Ball one to start the at-bat. The 1 0 home is laid off, but in there for strike one. Hard ground ball to third. Throw to first will be in time, and there's one gone here to start the second. That is it. The first baseman, number 25. So digging in now, number 25, hitting just a bit over the Mendoza line on the year. The pitch. And this runs inside, and that looked like it got him pretty good. That is good. So one gone in the inning here with the runner at first. And that'll bring up the dual threat of Shohei Otani. From the stretch, here's the pitch. Ready with the nothing in one pitch. Here's a fastball at the knees. Good spot, good pitch, and it's 0 2. And a swing and a miss as they got him with the slider there, two away. That swing tells me he was really trying to get a pitch out front and rip it down the line, but that wasn't a great pitch to do it on. It's really not the best two strike approach either. Here's Justin Upton now. As he'll wait out a breaking pitch here that finds the zone for strike one. Upton, originally from the state of Virginia, is in the midst of his 14th major league season, so I guess you could say baseball has been good to him. Yeah, Maddie, no kidding right there. I'll tell you what, the grind to get to the big leagues is so hard. Guys just want, they just want to spend a month, a day in the big leagues. So to put yourself here for 12 years screams to your ability to adjust and be a great teammate. The bouncer to the left side. Throw to first in plenty of time, and the side is retired. Angels strand one. They trail it here, two to nothing. 
Anthony Santander the next to bat. He's got hits in each of the last five ball games. One of the keys to securing a win, they want to keep the pressure on and try to build that lead as much as they can moving into the later innings. Uh, trouble averted here as this is tapped out in front of the mound. Throw on to first in time, one away. Here's the catcher, Wilson Ramos. And you can see great numbers over the past few games. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. And look out as that fastball ran in and got him. Ouch, man. Well, this home crowd didn't like this guy in the mound before, but now they really don't like him. He's gotten the faithful all worked up by hitting one of their best hitters early on in this game. And you can bet he's really going to hear it if he comes around to score. Now at the plate, Victor Reyes. He flew out in his last at bat. He's set and the pitch. That's lifted the other way out to left. Upton's under it. And he makes the catch for the second out. Standing in, Labor Torres. He singled and scored in his first appearance in this one. Yeah, Matt, he pressure's off right now. He extended his hitting streak that last plate appearance. Now he gets to get back into his zone, work on his craft, and try and drive something in the gap. Owen won the count. From the belt, kicks and deals. Hopped up. Number 25, shading to his right, and that's the third out. Next will be the designated hitter, Taylor Ward. He's ready for his first at bat of this early season contest. Number three. And now pitch on the way. In there at the knees, strike one. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Garcia has a read on it, makes the play one away. Batting not. So there's the first out here in the Angels' third, and the catcher Max Stassi will be the next to bat. Now here's the pitch. Into the windup, here comes the 0-1. Changed up on him here, and this is grounded to short. Fielded cleanly. Throw gets him, two down. So it's back to the top of the order now. And standing in one of the best two strike hitters in baseball, Andrelton Simmons. First pitch is a slider called for a strike. Well below the knees laid off on the change up there. Bases are empty here with two men out. Line drive to center field. Reyes is there and he'll make the catch to retire the side. Angels go down one, two, three. They're still down. It's two nothing. Striding into the box, Rafael Duque. He singled his last time up. Not shortstop. Rafael Duque. Here comes the first pitch. Skied into straightaway right. Otani is there. One pitch, one out. And before we get much further, time for a look at the standings entering play today as you see where the Angels find themselves in the American League West. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Miguel Cabrera is in for his second plate appearance as he looks at a ball. It's 1-0. and And the pitch. Hit hard to third. On to first, and very quickly, two are gone here in the home third. 
Now that right field. So bases are empty here with two gone. And that'll bring up Javi Sayul Garcia. Here comes the pitch for Garcia. Popped him up. Number 25 waits on it. And that's the third out. Into the box, David Fletcher. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Things not looking very good so far in this one, but we're still in the middle innings. They're down by a couple of runs, and this. There's a swing, and he sends a ball high in the air into left field, and that is off the wall. And he will get there as the Angels are in business with a leadoff double. So up until this point, they've had to bite and scratch for every single thing. But he puts a good swing on this one and nearly knocks it out of the park. So we'll see if it's contagious and his partner can pick him up right here. Mike Trout is next as he finds himself behind 0-1. Has a look, now the pitch. Trout is really a rare talent in this sport. A true five-tool player, as they say, which means he can make an impact in a game at any time. Really a joy to watch, not someone you want to take your eye off of. Yeah, this guy's worth the price of a ticket. Just to watch his tool set, but not only that, the way he grinds at the plate, the way he battles defensively, this guy is one of the true superstars in our game. He throws him on the fastball there. Mike Trout goes down to become the first out here in the fourth. So a runner on second with one down now. And the next hitter will be the right-handed bat of Anthony Rendon. No balls in one strike. Nothing in one count. Here it comes. There's strike two as the slider hits the outside corner. Fletcher leads off second with one gun in the inning. Line drive to center field. Reyes is there now, and he has it to gone. The batter, number 25. So striding in, number 25, runner in scoring position with two gone. Little chopper back to the mound. Throw in time, and the side is retired. So it's no runs on a hit, no errors, and a man left. On now to the bottom half of inning number four. Venezuela is out in front here, two to nothing. At the plate, Renato Nunez. An RBI double is what he was credited with his first time around. Yeah, he did a great job to go down and get that one his last at bat. But I got to think they're going to pitch him up, maybe elevate something in the zone. Interested to see how he approaches this next oh, AB. Strike one to start the at bat. The wind up and the 0 1. Scorch to third. Throw on to first, and one third baseman grounds out to the other, one away. So with one gone, here's Carlos Gonzalez. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Lifted the other way out to left center. Trout on the run, but he won't have a play. This is down and into the gap. And he'll pull into second with one away. Boy, after that base knock right there, D-Roll, he extends his hitting streak to seven games. Yeah, and you can tell he's made some necessary adjustments at the plate. Anytime you're getting a knock every day of the week, you're doing things right. He's keeping that front shoulder tucked, staying inside the ball, not trying to do too much. So now to the plate, Anthony Santander. Trout has a read on it. Two gone. At the plate, Wilson Ramos. Here's the first pitch to him. And no swing, apparently. Ball one. <laughs> hey, you think the game plan is to pitch this guy inside? They plunked him in the first at bat, and they're clearly coming right back in again. Hit hard towards center. And that's in there. Base hit. Gonzalez blows through the stop sign headed for home safe at the plate as they push their lead to three now 
Boy, that's an aggressive send there, Hewitt, well, because this outfielder has a very strong throwing arm. Yeah, and when you're sitting in the hitter's meeting, that stuff they go over. So every base runner is on notice knowing that this guy's got one of the strongest arms in the league, but they challenged him, and it worked. to the plate now Victor Reyes nope, as the ball. first pitch years have been high it's ball one nope, he's one hitless all. in his two at bats so far a swing and a high drive to right center field back goes Trout and this will kick off the base of the wall. So now they'll have two men in scoring position following the two out double. You know, Dero, I'm not sure if you're one of those superstitious guys, but a 13 game hitting streak seems like a pretty good number for this guy. Yeah, that's the old Baker's dozen right there. We're almost looking at two weeks of just sleeping like a baby. I can't be, you're going to hear me reiterate this throughout this streak. I can't tell you when you're swinging the bat like this, your food tastes better, your wife gets prettier, everything is just working. And that'll bring up Glaber Torres. On to first, and that'll do it as they manage to not let this inning get out of hand. So it's a run on three hits, no errors, and two men left on. We played four full. Venezuela leads this one three to nothing. All set for the start of the inning, and next it'll be the outfielder, Shohei Otani. Ready with the first pitch, here it comes. And here's one that misses to the leadoff man in the inning. The number six hitter in the lineup. It's ball one. Two and oh. Sometimes it can be difficult for a pitcher. You're facing a guy that's not known to be a big stick in the lineup. Sometimes the toughest thing is to be aggressive and throw strikes. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Reyes is there and he has it for the first out. The left fielder, number striding three. in Justin Upton Justin. he's 0 for 1 Up after here. grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far a ball and no strikes no runs two hits and no errors to this point for the Angels a 2 and 0 count to the Angels left fielder hey after those two breaking balls missed you have to be sitting on a fastball right here from the wind up the 2 0 pitch the count now at two and one. Not surprised he's laid on a heater right there. Just saw an off speed pitch. Wanted to stay back a little bit too long. And Upton lays off again, and he's in control of the count. It's three and one. Team's been struggling on offense. Let your D work for you right here. Pound the zone. And Upton will reach as he looks at ball four. Well, he loses him there, but that's just the first walk now he's back. given up, along Number with a couple three. of hits, so his command has been pretty solid so far. Now at the play, Taylor Ward. So far, 0 for 1 with a flyout. He's set. Here it comes. Ball left outside. Now the 1-0. Is swung on and missed in that strike one. And he lays off for a ball, two and one. Wanted to get the front door curveball on the inside corner there, but it backed up a little and stayed off the corner. The 2 1 home. Waves and misses for strike number two. Runner at first here, one man out. Three and two, the count is full to the Angels' DH. Not a bad time right here to put that runner in motion. Three, two count, you send the runner, and if it's a bad pitch, it's ball four. Now here's a fly ball, well hit. Back goes Garcia at the track, and it's gone! A two-run blast to straightaway right field. Second home run early in the year. And the Angels are back within one. It's a 3-2 ball game now. 
Well, they were a lot more comfortable up three than they are now, only up by one. That just goes to show you one pitch, one two-run shot, and the entire complexion of a game can change just like that. At the plate, Max Stassi. And he'll look at a breaking ball that misses for ball one. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. The 1-0. On a line, that's a base hit. Hey guys, he's lucky he's getting his baseball back. He hung that middle of the plate. The batter's eyes lit up and he was able to put good wood on it. Ready once again, Andrelton Simmons hit the ball pretty well in his last at bat, but it resulted in a line out. Owen won the count. On oh, its tailor made to short. Six, four, three. It's a double play, and the inning is over. But the Angels get two, both on this two run home run. On to the bottom of the fifth. The All-Stars on top, three to two. Bottom of the inning now. And stepping up as the shortstop, Rafael Duque. Not shortstop, Rafael Duque. First pitch of the at-bat on its way. That softly hit to right. Will that get down? Fletcher has it, and it's a quick out number one. So the bases are empty with one man gone. And that brings in Miguel Cabrera. First offering on its way. Here's a slider that's inside 1 0. It's no wonder this guy's pitch count is so low. If they keep swinging on the first pitch, he's got a real chance to go deep into this one. Smoked on the ground up the middle. Oh, look at the sliding stop. How about that? The bat, the right so Other bases side. are empty here with two gone, and yeah, that'll yeah. bring up Avisayu Garcia. First pitch coming, here it is. Hammered the other way to deep right field. Ranging back is Otani. He can't get there, so the inning will continue. Around second now and headed for third. And he is all the way over to third now with a two-out triple. Now batting, third base. You take a look at this one as it flies into the gap. Both Good outfielders yeah. give it a chase, but they can't catch up to it. Next thing you know it, one hops the wall, and he's busting his hump around second on his way to third. Into the box now, Renato Nunez. As he'll reach unsuccessfully at a slider away, it's strike one. A hit in two at-bats for him at this point in the ballgame. Breaking ball below the zone, that's ball one. Lots of hits given up, but so far, no walks. At least he's making them work to get on base. Problem is, they haven't had to work too hard. A two and one count to Nunez. We're starting to see a lot more balls from him now, and that's a direct result of him getting hit around pretty good. He's trying to do something different, and it's resulting in him not tacking the strike zone anymore. Count even at two and two. Here's the two and two. Ground ball sent back up the middle. And that's through into center field. Base hit. And they'll extend their lead even further as the run from third is in to score. Hey, there's a good job of battling right there, d -Row. Pitcher had the advantage with two outs, two strikes. You're one pitch away. And boy, what a terrific piece of hitting right there. Yeah, that's a great job right there. Some guys are not afraid to hit with two strikes. They'll take that pitcher deep in the count, feeling comfortable about it. That's the type of hitter this guy is, and he was able to come through. At the plate now, Carlos Gonzalez. As the first pitch misses to him, it's ball one. Oh. 
the 1-0. Now here's a shot out toward the gap in right center. Nunez isn't stopping. Here he comes to the plate. Now the relay home. And he's going to get in there at the plate to make it a 5-2 lead now. And that just pains a pitcher. They're already giving up a run in the inning. And he has two outs, almost out of trouble, but then serves up a mistake. The runner busted around the bases to score from first. And the hitter is in scoring position on second. Into the box, Anthony Santander. Nope. As he'll take a look at the pitch too low. It's ball one. Two out here and a runner at second. Into right field. That's a base hit. The throw to third. Throw won't get him. Hey, after that hit right there, Bilo, that extends his hitting streak to six games. Yeah, no doubt about it. Six days in a row with Knox will help you sleep better at night, Dan. And that'll bring up Wilson Ramos. Hit hard to the right side. Foul. Here comes the 0-1. Here's a breaking ball, but it doesn't quite find the strike zone. The 1-1 is swung on and missed for strike number two. He hasn't thrown that pitch much all game. I got to believe as an offense, you just got to throw that pitch away and move on to the next one. Got him swinging, and that will end the inning. So it's two runs on four base hits. No errors and a couple of men left on. We're through five here at the ballpark. The All-Stars are out in front here, five to two. Digging in and looking for more, David Fletcher. He doubled his last time through. Yeah, he jumped all over that first pitch last time up. Interested to see if he has the same approach to A.B. He's right there. Throw to first gets him, so the leadoff man's retired here to begin the sixth. Now that the third. Now at the plate, Mike Trout. He was punched out looking at strike three last time through. First pitch of the at-bat. Changed up on him and dropped it in for a called strike. Pitcher wants to have a quick inning right here. Capitalize on the momentum his batters have. Grounded weakly down the line toward third. But that'll get foul. It's 0-2 now. Breaking ball that time that misses out of the zone. Hey, this is a real pesky hitter right here. As a pitcher, you really like to keep this guy off the bases. This is a guy that kind of sets the tables for big innings. And this is swung out and missed, so it's two up, two down to start the sixth inning. Boy, and that's really disappointing for a guy that has wheels, right? All he wants to do is get on base and take advantage of the strength of his game, which is his speed. But with the strikeout right there, you can't get on first base if you strike out. Anthony Rendon stands in for the third time now as he takes a look at a ball. It's 1-0. Grounded down the third baseline, but a foul ball, 1-1. One one. Just off the outside that time, laid off for a ball. Chopped at third. He's got it. Throw to first will get him easily, and the side is retired. Angels are gone in order, and the deficit remains 5-2. to two. Matt Andrees enters to do the pitching in the bottom of the sixth. So the batting order turns over now and set to go. Victor Reyes, he'll try to follow up the double in his last at-bat with another big hit right here. Here comes the first pitch. And he fouls this one off.
back up the middle. And this is going to scoot on through into center for a base hit leading off the inning. Hey, pitchers, you better start taking notice of this guy. He better be circled on that lineup card because he's on fire. That's his second hit of the ball game right there, and I don't see him stop. So now to the plate, Torres. On a line, that's a base hit. Sometimes the first pitch is the best pitch you'll see all at bat. How Definitely bad. coming out of his shoes. Aggressive style. First pitch. Base hit up the middle. To the plate now, Rafael Duque. On a rope to the second baseman. Throw back to second, and that's a double play. On to first. They got him. A triple play. So they pick up no runs on two hits, no errors, and none left. Seventh inning coming up. The All-Stars are out on top, 5-2. to two. Now batting, number 25. He's 0 for 1 thus far. The first baseman, number 25. Here's the first pitch to him. There's a breaking ball that couldn't quite catch the inside. Line to the right side. And this is into the alley and ought to be good for extra bases. And he's going to get to second now with nobody out. You could tell he was thinking okay. fastball all the way here, and that's exactly what he got. He was able to get the bat head out front and pull it into the gap in the right center. Now they're set up pretty nicely for a good inning after that leadoff double. Shohei Otani is at the plate now, and he takes a cold strike. 0-1, here's the pitch. Hit down the line at first. Cabrera's got it, and it's a productive first out as that runner's able to advance 90 feet up to third here. Justin Upton the next to hit. A time run standing on deck, which means he'll be looking to get on base any way he can. Try to check it, and it's 0-1. Ball one as he lays off below the zone. Out of play. Upton awaits the one two. Hit out towards second. Throw will get him for the second out, but meanwhile, the run is in to score from third. Good manufactured run right there. Lead off double, move him over with the ground ball, and just put the ball in play and let him come home. Make scoring runs look easier than it actually is. Taylor Ward is at the plate now as he looks at strike one. Set up away with the changeup, but it's one and one. Good change of speeds, but he lays off two and one. Three runs, five hits, and no errors to this point for the Angels. And he can't catch the corner here, so he's behind three and one. When you're playing close games like this, base runners mean everything, so he can ill afford to start giving away free passes. Hit hard to the right, but foul. Strike three called as he can't get the bat off his shoulders. Side retired. So it's one run on one hit. No errors and no one left. Seventh inning stretch time here at the ballpark. Venezuela is on top here. Five to three. The first baseman Miguel Cabrera stands in. He's hitless in three at-bats to this point. Miguel Cabrera comes set here's the nothing and nothing pitch now a big here's the pitch a swing and a drive sent out toward the gap and oh he missed a home run by a matter of feet it's off the wall and he'll pull into second here with nobody out any hitter will tell you that a shot like that just feels different it sounds different off the bat you see his arms get extended right arm tucked up against his body 
barrel the bat all over the ball, and he smokes it right off the wall at left center. A little more hang time, and that one probably gets out of here. So here is Abisayo Garcia, fouled away. So far, two for three in this one. Here comes the pitch for Garcia. And this one's in the dirt. And he'll hurry back to second here as he was wise to not push it that time. On its way, the 0-2 pitch. And on 0-2, he misses with a fastball. Well, there's the classic 0-2 wasted fastball. Not even close to the zone. We'll see what he throws on the next pitch. The 1-2. It's a fastball that misses. He started this guy backwards, a couple of off-speed pitches early, followed by back-to-back -back heaters. He can go either way he wants to go right now. And this is swung on and missed, and boy, they took care of a key man there. One away. He showed right there why having a good changeup is so valuable. Two and two, and he flips one up there that the bottom really falls out at the last minute. It's so hard to pick up, and it's even harder to make good contact with. Stepping in now, Renato Nunez, and it's fouled away. Looking at his lifetime numbers, Nunez has a slugging percentage a little over 425, a respectable number. Right there, and it's quickly 0-2 now. Popped him up. Simmons is calling for it. And he brings it in for the second out of the inning. Striding forward now is the DH, Carlos Gonzalez. He's two for three and looking for more here. First offering on its way. Who started him with the change, and it's nothing in one. Runner in scoring position at second with two down. Fastball and he's quickly in the hole 0 and 2. Ball. Down and away it's a ball and two strikes. A swing and a miss as he chased with two strikes and that will retire the side. So striding forward now, Max Stassi. He'll start things out for us here in inning number eight. Here's the first pitch to him. The windup and the 0-1. Outside for a ball, one and one. Ball and two strikes to the Angels catcher. One and two. One two offering looked like a slider that time, but it's two and two. Hit in the air out to center field. Reyes is right there, one down. So now to the plate will be Andrelton Simmons. He could really use a knock here, 0 for 3 in the game so far. Hit hard down the right field line. But a foul ball. Awfully close with the slider there, but it's one and one. This is line to left, but pretty much right at the left fielder as he takes it in for the second out. Now that second base. Coming to the plate now, David Fletcher. Only four outs remaining for them to try and rally back in this one. Just off the outside, and it's 1-0. and Soft liner to the right side, and that'll get down for a two-out single. Man, he's seeing it like a beach ball right now. Even his soft contact is finding holes there. He's making it nearly impossible for a pitcher right now. Up, down, in and out, hard, soft. 
anything you throw forward to home. Now here comes Ron Gardenhire up out of the dugout. And he's going to motion for the bullpen as that'll be all for his starter this afternoon. So as he departs, he'll remain responsible for the man left the board, but he cannot lose this one. Your attention, please. New pitcher coming on now, the right-hander Yusmero Petit. First pitch of the at bat. Mike Trout is in with two away now as he looks at a called strike one. A runner on first with two away. Hit on the ground is short. Quick throw to Torres to retire the side. Angels leave one. They're still down 5 3. Felix Pena is on to pitch out of the bullpen in the bottom half of the eighth. Now here it comes. Pena offers up perhaps one of the nastiest sliders around and it won't be uncommon to see a lot of off balance swings against it and it'll be easy to see why once you see it come out of his hand he's got a huge break on it behind 0 and 2 now nothing in two count and the pitch swing and a miss as he couldn't connect on the two seamer and that's out number one pretty textbook pitching right there jump ahead and account 0 2 and then start working catcher, outside the zone three. easier said than Real done fair. but that's the way to do it Bravo. now here it comes a swing and a drive sent out toward the gap and that ball gets down out near the wall and should be extra bases just goes to show if you're going to throw that two seam fastball away which I don't think is the best pitch anyway you better start that thing out of the zone and let it work its way back to the corner with this one it started out on the corner so it leaked back right over the heart of the plate and got whacked at the plate Victor Reyes as the first pitch to him is off the plate for a ball one and oh it's been a two for four effort for him so far in the ball game. Line towards center field and that's into the outfield for a one out hit. Nice piece of hitting right there kept his shoulders square his hands inside the baseball and was able to fight off a good nice executed pitch for a knock. Standing in now, Torres. Right back to the mound. Could be an easy two. There's one. On to first as they get the double play to get him out of the inning. So it's no runs on two hits, no errors, and one man left on. Ninth inning coming up. Venezuela leads it 5-3. to three. All set to start the ninth in this one, and that'll bring up Andrew. Jenmar Gomez comes on from the pen, hoping to finish this one off here in the top of the ninth. Now pitching, Jenmar Gomez. Outfield in the no doubles defense. Now the first pitch. One and one to count. Hit on the ground to third. And that is in the left field. So the leadoff man's aboard to kick off the ninth. So he waited till the ninth inning, but he comes through here to extend the hit streak. That was close. Yeah, Matty B, you see that wry smile of him coming out of the box right there. He knew what was on the line. He'd be lying if he didn't. But there's a lot of pressure on him because you're walking into that batter's box thinking, I have a nice streak going, and this is more than likely going to be my last A.B. He comes through in the clutch. He's working on a one-for-two game so far. That evens it up, one and one.
Hit hard to the right side, but foul. And a changeup swung on and missed for the first down. Well, there's the great equalizer, the changeup, El Cambio. Listen, if you can keep that pitch in your back pocket and pull it out when you need it, like he did right there, usually hitters, they don't stand a chance. Shohei Otani digging in next. Pitch popped up. Nunez in foul ground. And no one can get there. It's a foul ball. Runners on first with one down. And this misses the outside corner, so it's knotted up at one and one. Hey, he threw that pitch with a purpose to get a double play. Good job to let it go by, though, as a hitter. I changed things up on him, and he got him to swing through it. One and two now. Good thing he didn't make contact with that pitch. Only thing he could do is probably hit that on the ground. It could be a double play ball. Struck him out, so he set down on strikes for the second time today. That's back-to-back -back strikeouts now as they've been unable to advance that leadoff single into scoring position. Yeah, clearly no problems working out of the stretch right now, Matt. He's taking control this inning after giving up that hit. Now we'll see if he can finish it off strong as well. Hits this one hard the other way. Throw on to first is in time to get him. And the All-Stars have come back to even up this series at a game apiece as this ball game is over. It's always nice to give your fans at home something to cheer about. And they definitely did that right here. Coming through with a big win at home. 5-3 to three, the final score in this afternoon's game. The All-Stars jumped out to an early lead in the first and never looked back. Antonio Senzatella notches his third win of the year. Genmar Gomez records the save, his eighth of the season. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to the show name.